folks here in Pikeville get the show on Mountaintop TV. It's been, you all have had it from the beginning, and I, I can't thank you enough for having, the, for having it here. And, and it's been a real blessing to do. And by the way, if I end up not running, I'm going to go back and do the show again because it's it's absolutely been a joy for me to do. And you know, we've won an Emmy, we're nominated again. It's been great. And I don't think this needed to happen. With that said, I understand the position the station is in. I think one of the people that uh, is also considering or in this race uh, sort of pushed this, and it frustrates me. If I or anybody were to file for office, file, then the law requires the television or radio station to offer the other candidates the same thing I get. So if I were to file, they have to offer Mitch McConnell a two-hour radio show. But I can't imagine what it would be like. But they have to offer it to him. Now, if he doesn't accept it, then they're good. But none of that starts until I file. And right now, I haven't filed. Right now, I don't even think Mitch McConnell has filed. Amy McGrath hasn't filed, so none of the laws apply. So I've seen a lot of people online going, well, WLAX had to do this. No, they didn't. The law doesn't start until I file, and I, of course, haven't even decided to run, much less file. Neither has anybody else. The filing deadline is not until January. So I hope folks understand and give me some time to like, I've said this before and I mean it. I'm gonna wake up one morning and God's gonna tell me what to do one way or the other.